Snow came early to the island of Sodor. It was heavier than usual. Most engines hate snow. Donald and Douglas were used to it. Coupled back to back with a van between their tenders and a snowplow on their fronts, they set to work. They puffed backwards and forwards patrolling the line. Generally, the snow slipped away easily, but sometimes they found deeper drifts. Presently, they came to a drift which was larger than most. They charged it and were just backing for another try when... Help! Help! Lord's sakes, Donald! It's Henry! Don't worry yourself, Henry! Wait a while! We'll have you out! Henry was very grateful. He saw all was not well. The twins were looking glum. They told him Sir Topham Hatt was making a decision. He'll send us away for sure. It's a shame, said Percy. A lot of nonsense about a broken signal box, grumbled Gordon. That spiteful brake van, too, put in James. Good riddance, that's what I say. The twins were splendid in the snow, added Henry. It isn't fair. They all agreed that something must be done, but none knew what. Percy decided to talk to Edward about it. What you need, said Edward, is a deputation. He explained what that was. Percy ran back quickly. Edward says we need a, a depot station. Of course, said Gordon. The question is, what is a desperation? asked Henry. It's when engines tell Sir Topham Hatt something's wrong, said Percy. Did you say tell Sir Topham Hatt? asked Duck thoughtfully. There was a long silence. I propose, said Gordon, that Percy be our uh, disputation. Me? squeaked Percy. I can't. Rubbish, Percy, said Henry. It's easy. That's settled then, said Gordon. Poor Percy wished it wasn't. Hello, Percy. It's nice to be back. Percy jumped. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Please, sir. You look nervous, Percy. What's the matter? Please, sir, uh, they've, they've made me a desperation, sir, uh, to, sp to speak to you, sir. I, I don't like it, sir. Sir Topham Hatt pondered. Do you mean a deputation, Percy? Yes, sir, please, sir. Uh, it's Donald and Douglas. They say, sir, that if you send them away, sir, w well, they'll be turned into scrap, sir. That would be dreadful, sir. Uh, please, sir, don't send them away. Thank you, Percy. That will do. Later, Sir Topham Hatt spoke to the engines. I had a, a deputation. I understand your feelings, and I've given a lot of thought to the matter. He paused impressively. Donald and Douglas, I hear that your work in the snow was good. You shall have a new coat of paint. The twins were surprised. Thank ye, sir. But your names will be painted on you. We'll have no more mistakes. Thank ye, sir. Uh, d does this mean that the both of us... Sir Topham Hatt smiled. It means... But the rest of his speech was drowned in a delighted chorus of cheers and whistles. The twins were here to stay. <laughs>